And Dame Mayor Nan Whaley met with leaders of the Ohio Restaurant Association today. They discuss how she and other government officials can support the industry that's been hit very hard by this pandemic. And 2 News reporter Lee Williamson joins us live with more on that very important conversation. Mark, today local restaurant owners got that chance to talk one on one with Mayor Whaley about what's affecting their businesses the most as the pandemic continues to worsen. Mayor Whaley says we fought an uphill battle, but she believes we're now heading downhill and can see an end to this crisis. We are struggling as a whole, all of us are. An impassioned plea for help from Brody Danner, owner of Submarine House. It does not matter across the board, we are all struggling. And uh, the more that we can receive help from not only the clientele, but from, from the, the mayors and the governor, and it, it helps. Danner and three other local restaurant owners joined the president of the Ohio Restaurant Association at Wee Penny Bar and Grill to talk with Dayton Mayor Nan Whaley. They say the cost of PPE, safety enhancements in their dining rooms, and delivery fees from services like DoorDash and Grubhub are crushing them financially. Not only are our revenues being restricted and, and being cut, but our costs are through the roof. Mayor Whaley says she supports more federal funding for these businesses being hit hard. Restaurants and service businesses have felt this way, way more than other other parts of our economy. And so that's why that federal stimulus round two, round two is really, really important. And she's encouraging Ohioans to support these businesses safely. But I want people to think about supporting local businesses while they're doing this. And there are ways to do that when you're picking up something for dinner, go get a carry out of curbside. These folks are making it super easy. That's what we're asking folks to do. Dine Safe Across Ohio Week is an effort by the Ohio Restaurant Association to support businesses like the ones you just heard from. Now this ends tomorrow. Coming up on 5 on 2, hear how restaurants are surviving the pandemic and what hope they're leaning on for the future. Right now, I'm live in the studio, Aaliyah Williamson, 2 News, working for you.